It's amazing what happens when you put your phone away, when all of the distractions that, it, that that world, that digital world holds for you are gone and you're left with your real life. Nothing more and nothing less. So many times at the beginning when you um, get off social media or you start having more boundaries around your phone, it's really quite shocking how, um, how much needs to be done. <laughs> you look around and you're like, oh my God, I didn't realize my dishes had backed up that much or that pile of bills or just things that have been neglected, like maybe you've been neglected. And that's definitely what I, what I realized. I this front porch is my therapy. It's my place of coming back to myself. It's a place of meeting other people. It's, it does kind of feel like going back in time, slowing down and realizing that all you need is another person for endless amounts of um, entertainment, but also just for peace, just the comfort of being with another person and not having to edit yourself or say the right thing or do the right thing. Just being with somebody. But one of the things that's been the most healing to me about my time on the porch is that it changes my perspective of the world. If I look at what the media tells me the world is like and people are like today, it's very discouraging. And it doesn't seem like it's a really good thing to be in the world right now. But sitting on my front porch and meeting all of the people who walk by my house and so many of them come up and visit with me like, wow, we really do live in a beautiful world filled with beautiful people. But you have to slow down to pay attention to that. And the front porch is the perfect place to do that. Mm -hmm.